Diddy refutes the startling charge made by Aubrey O'Day in the latest documentary. Diddy refutes statements made by his erstwhile collaborator Aubrey O'Day in the initial documentary concerning his legal ordeal. The documentary TMZ presents, the downfall of Diddy on Tubai was made available to the public over the weekend. The one-hour special offers in-depth analysis of all the shocking claims, multiple legal actions, and raids that brought attention to the ongoing federal sex trafficking investigation. The documentary features a number of well-known characters, such as singer Aubrey O'Day. The ex-member of Danity Kane stated in her interview that Diddy attempted to get her to sign a non-disclosure agreement in return for her publishing rights. That is untrue, a Diddy representative informed TMZ. According to the representative, Aubrey O'Day's big break came when she was cast by Diddy and Bad Boy for their show with her group, Danity Kane. Not all artists signed an NDA, despite what she claims, when he reassigned his portion of the publishing to Bad Boy artists last year, an unprecedented move within the industry and something he did not have to do. O'Day stated that she received an offer of $300.30 in total for both her silence and her publishing rights. The musician claimed that she turned down the offer since she is already earning a respectable living without Diddy's assistance. Considering everything that is going on in the troubled mogul's life, O'Day expressed her gratitude that she declined him. Most fans are aware that O'Day is a fervent supporter of free speech and has spent years denouncing Diddy's dubious business tactics. The singer declared, I got the publishing deal, I know what it says, and I know how much money it was giving me. You want to know, $300.30. For the complete settlement of all disputes involving Diddy and numerous other players. She went on, I believe he was taking action to silence as many people as possible. I was made whole financially again. But when I looked at the publishing deal, it said anything but that. It actually requested that I give up access to my experience and narrative. It expressly requested that I keep quiet and never disparage anyone.